Hello, Aries. Rambling Mike here. I'm going to play a little bit of tarot with you. Thanks for tuning in one more time. Appreciate your time and your view. That I do. Thanks for the like. What are you thinking about it? So very kind of you. I always want to take a minute and thank many, many, many of my Aries friends. Huge supporters of Rambling Mike. If you ever blessed me in any way, shape, or form, Aries, thank you. So very kind of you. Got to pull some love cards here for you tonight. Playing with the Gilded Tarot Royale. Uh, going to do the He Said, She Said, clarifiers uh, with Dancing in the Dark. I'm going to start your spread with some love cards because I'm looking for a love story around here. And a couple of majors to top it off. All that being said. Let's do it. Aries. Aries, love team. First card out, Aries. Here we go. Here we go. Trust. This situation's calling for you to have faith. Oh. What's that about? Looks like somebody... Somebody may want your attention. Trust came out. I wonder if somebody broke, broke the trust rule. Situation's calling for you to have faith. Here we go. Here we go. Aries. 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 Somebody that you know, somebody that you know, this could be the one. You may have already met the romantic partner that you seek. Somebody, somebody maybe, <laughs> uh, you know, uh, wanting your attention again. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, here we go, here we go, Aries. Got some Aries getting up, running for the door. Molding the door, got other Aries. Pull some more cards on that, Mike. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go, man. Aries. Aries. Aries, babies. <laughs> Unrequited love came out. You know, for me, that can talk about maybe a season where Aries was giving too much to a situation and somebody took it for granted. Somebody took your love for granted. They may be changing the way they're thinking about that. Give me some more on this. Unrequited love came out. There is a playfulness card that's underneath there. I don't know. It says to recapture romance, allow your inner youthful spirit of fun to shine. Well, I wish them the best right here. I wish them the best. There is a forgiveness card here. It says you deserve love. There's a forgiveness card here. That's a healing family card. And very soon, clearly decide what you want. <laughs> okay, all right. Looks like Mr. and Mrs. Red Flags is going to bust a move around here, Aries. Uh huh. Yeah, somebody's realized that great loves were taking the steps that they're guided to take. I see you, full force, loving on you right now. All right, let's play some tarot on this. Let's play some tarot on this, huh? Aries, Aries, babies, I want you to do what's best for you. Aries, looks like, looks like the eclipse has hit somebody right in the back of their pumpkin head. They realize, uh, probably blew something really good right here. Give me a card right here. Overall energy for Aries, please. Aries, please. Aries, overall energy for my Aries. What's that? Oh, it's Aries seated in your power. I don't know, it could be somebody's divine masculine too, right? Male or female. Mm -hmm. But this is Aries seated in your power. It's your major arcana. Let me give you that. 
Aries, seated in your power, divine masculine energy. I'm telling you, somebody wants to, there's justice right here, another major arcana. And that is an energy of somebody wanting to fix something around here. Somebody wanting to bring balance to a situation. It was definitely out of balance, wasn't it? Unrequited love's here. We gotta watch that, right? We gotta watch that. We really need to meet people where they're at, right? Because, uh, well, a lot of people just uh, act like a fool when you go over the top for them. Anyway. Give me some cards right here. Make the effort. Make the effort. It's Mr. and Mrs. Uh, Unrequited Love. Um, coming in here to make an effort. Trust and faith on Aries' part. They could be the one, right? Loving yourself first. You get a playfulness card on there. Knowing that you deserve love. Healing family issues. They clearly decide what you want. Give me a card on this. Aries, babies. Aries. The Empress. Oh my goodness, what is this? Wow. That's the Emperor and the Empress and a big justice. Wow. Could it be, huh? Could it be? Could it be? Could it be? Emperor and Empress with justice in between them. That's the balancing. Karma. Here we go. Very positive overall. Give me some on this. Give me some on this for Aries, babies. Aries. <laughs> yeah, it's a reevaluation card. Uh, let me look in that cup. Um, I'm busy over here right now. <laughs> I'm working on my world these days. Um, what's in that cup? <laughs> Four cups. It's a reevaluation card. Give me some on this. Aries. 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 <laughs> it's a slow pony. I'm giggling right here. It's a slow pony showing up around here, Aries. They may have some earth in their chart. Well, you know. <laughs> Looks like the slow pony has chosen the path that they want to go down. Who is this? This is Aries over here, male or female? Yeah, the slow pony, huh? The slow pony. Has, uh, decide, the, slow po the slow ponies made a decision. Now it's up to you, huh? You got to clearly decide what you want over here. I think it's because you, you is a strength card right here. You just said, you know, if you don't know how to love on me right, you got to go sit down and think about it. Even if it's an emperor and an emperor's story, you just told him, you know, um, you know, uh, I got to go. I got to go. We'll just give it to the God. Look at Major Arcanas. Temperance, the angel of the middle way just showed up around here. You know, that's about balancing the 5D. This is about balancing the 3D. So this is Aries just gave it to God, didn't you? Or the gods or whoever that is. Huh? You just put it into God's hands, didn't you? <laughs> Here comes that cop, man. Here it comes. Here it comes. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Give me some on this love story for Aries. Aries. Oh, it's my two soulmates. It's five of pentacles. Yeah, these two miss each other. When one feels left out in the cold, the other one does too. Two of cuppers showing up around here with an emperor and an empress story. My two soulmates. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Give me some Aries. <laughs> wow, sudden change. That's an Aries card right there. Boom! Oh, did, you, you, did you pull the plug on this? You probably pulled the plug on this, didn't you? It seems to bring some kind of sudden change. You know, we got eclipse energy right here. We got eclipse energy. Yeah. Yeah. Couple more. Couple more. 
couple more imprint imprint story right here. Got sudden change through my two. It's Aries. Look at you, man. It's a magician. Another major arcana, right? And the magician, to be honest with you, is a card for me about pure positive thoughts and pure positive words. It's a co-creative energy with the divine. As above, so below. This sudden change coming in here. Sudden change. Five of Pentacles, my two soulmates. Uh, faith is here, huh? Faith is here. Clearly deciding what you want. You got some forgiveness here too, huh, Aries? Looks like, looks like they really could make the effort. I mean, that was the first card out, right? Great loves were taking the steps you're guided to take. And uh, looks like somebody's being guided. I don't know. I wish them the best. I wish these old slow ponies the best right here. They finally seem to have set their intentions about, you know, you. That's, like, that's that holy light, that glory light shining down. It says, you said, go sit down and think about yourself. And we just give it to the gods. And look at, look at, look at Michael. Look at Michael shining off five pins right here. Yeah. And then bam, sudden change with two of cups. That's, you know, my magician. It's an Aries card. Okay, let's see. Emperor Emperor's story. Got justice. Got justice in it. Aries, who are you thinking about right here? So Emperor Emperor's story. Hey, what are they thinking and feeling about Aries these days? It's Aries for everything and feeling about Aries these days. Give me a card, please. The Wheel of Destiny. Another major arcana. I mean, <laughs> how many majors do we need in these readings? That's the old Wheel of Destiny. That's the Wheel of Return. That's the wheel of change for the better. That's what they're thinking about. Change for the better. They're thinking about you and maybe hoping that you're single. But this is minor arcana empress energy right here. It's my independent, self-assured, confident business person right here. Got it going on without them. You got it going on without them. It says they know it. Nine swords, the woodas, the kudas, the shudas, the ringing of the hands, the sleepless nights. Nines. Look at your nine. Oh, damn, they may be in trouble. And look at their nine. Anyway, there's a ten, so there's going to be a shift here. Look at there they are right there. They, they've been out in the backyard chopping some wood. <laughs> <laughs> getting ready, getting ready, getting ready to come in here. They don't want those lilies down there. They don't want lilies on this, no. No, they've been out in the backyard chopping wood. There they go, thinking about, thinking about coming in here and giving you a solid offer, Aries. Here, it's right here. It's right here. I wish them the best, see? See? Couldn't sleep at all last night. Been out in the backyard, cleaning up the backyard, <laughs> making everything right around here. Uh, oh, 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 thinking about destiny. Oh, Lord, thinking about you. Ooh, looking good, looking right. There we go, man. All right, what's Aries thinking and feeling about all this? What's Aries thinking and feeling about all this, man? Aries, 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 Aries. Eating five swords. <laughs> Damn it, no. Easy, easy. <laughs> yeah, I like it better over here with that faith card, right? Yeah, or the trust card, you know. What you talking about, Willis? What you talking about over here? Now sit down. <laughs> oh, what's this about? Uh, <laughs> go sit down and think about yourself when you ring my bells. <laughs> Nine cups. Yeah. I hope they're thinking about this. 
Oh, <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, man. You know, two cups is right here, man, in between all this. All right, Aries. Aries. What's Aries thinking and feeling about this over here? Woo! Aries, babies. Oh, ten wands. Ten wands is so, you know. We we put we put that heavy burden down, okay? We put that down, but you're still ringing my bells. <laughs> Damn it! Damn it! Here we go, Aries. Aries, give me one more. Give me one more. Give me one more. What do we got? Oh, it's the high priestess. Well, we got an emperor. I got an empress right here. I can say there's strong telepathy with you too if you're still resonating with this read. And the high priestess is real still. She doesn't. She doesn't. You know. She doesn't. Uh, she doesn't rush into anything. She doesn't rush into anything. Wow. Two aces underneath that. Aries up to the high priestess. It's an ace of cups. And an ace of swords. That's communication. Clarity. It looks like somebody's had an epiphany over here. And it looks like somebody, you know. That makes ten. It makes ten cups over there, my high priestess. <laughs> there's a little there's a little knight of wands. I wish you two the best right here. That's a great adventure right there. That's a great adventure. Fun story right here with an emperor and an empress, huh? A bunch of aces around here. Oh wow, look at this makes this makes ten swords for them. Oh my god. Somebody's in real regret. And over here we got we got look at you two. These two are mirroring each other in their own way. In their own way. Alright, I love you guys. Bun bunch of tens around here, man. It's about a cycle change. The big old wheel of fortune by two cups. Let's go. Give me a major on here for Aries, please. <laughs> That's Aphrodite's. She looks kind of bored. Like when? <laughs> you know, but that is an omen of good luck and good fortune. Another 10, another 10. Another 10 is on here. Another 10. One more, please. The wheel spins around here. It is the great alchemist. It is Michael. Aphrodite be like, when? That's Sagittarius. All I know is there's a chariot right there. As a chariot, big cancer. Big cancer. You know what's here, don't you? A hierophant. A hierophant, you too. Beautiful song as well. May all your dreams come true, Aries. Do what's best for you, huh? All my lovers, all my lovers. Enjoy this eclipse energy. Aries, if you made it to this point in the read, thanks for sticking around. Appreciate you. You know I do. Thanks for your like. Hopefully I've earned your subscription as one of your tarot readers. If I have Aries, uh, hit that subscription button for me right there. Ring my bell. Hit that old I like mic button. And I'm going to pull some cards here for you in a few short days. May all your dreams come true, Aries. Love and light. Bye for now. All right, all right, all right. We are halfway through.